everyone so yes this has been a few days since the last clip that you saw um, it's today is actually the last stage of contagion so after uh, today tomorrow I can uh, go out again and I feel so much better but I will still try to um, be mindful and stay away from a lot of people um, I haven't been able to I was thinking of recording my quarantine and what it's like and stuff but I was so my room is small and I don't have anything else to do besides browsing on my phone all day and it's really taken a toll on me as well because all I did was just laying down or sometimes I would just sort of walk a little bit um, my room but it's there's only so much you can do and I I really want to read and all that but I don't want to touch other stuff um, as I said because I don't want to have the need to sanitize all of course I will have to sanitize either way but not as you know um, just not too much and stuff and so I never touched my closet <laughs> I took out my sleeping um, my sleepwear straight out um, so I just put it outside and that's all like I I didn't do anything else I didn't I didn't even do my skincare just because I'm too scared but yeah um, today I feel so much better and I am enjoying my mom's food my mom made me this food uh, it's ginger pork one of my favorite food and I know that it's 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 gonna be good for my body as well bring warmth and all that um so I am going to drink <laughs> the sparkling eight the sparkling patient fruit eight I know it's it's fizzy water so it's gonna affect my throat and I know it's gonna make it itchy right I think so in my experience I think that's what's gonna happen but I'm just so tired of drinking water especially warm water all the time and um, I do love water but sometimes I could feel it in my mouth that you know if you I don't know if you drink too much water especially warm water for some reason it feels drier and I, I don't know so I'm gonna try this um, I'm wanting something sweet um, I've run out of my Gatorade I mean I could have just ordered more but I don't want to think about it so that's what I'm gonna do instead um, I tried to be more colorful today put on some little bit or something my hair is still a mess uh, I'm gonna take a shower again later tonight and then just gonna curl my hair for tomorrow and make it even better like so it'll make my day um, or my mood much better oh goodness I know it's gonna be bad no way. Not too fast, not too fast. Give yourself time to get used. And with water as well. Did you or did you not? So this question was asked by my friends before and I was like, there's no way. Um, my friend asked if you if um, any of us drink three kinds or more of beverages in one time you know just like me what I'm doing right now and all of my friends say of course yes and I'm like that's crazy I never done that but apparently I did <laughs> as soon as I said that I was drinking my coffee and then um, I had my water as well 
and then I had something else I forgot um, it was some sort of juice because my coffee was kind of bitter so I had something sweet as well but not too sweet and I looked at it and I was like oh my gosh I did it <laughs> I did the same thing that's crazy isn't it um, yeah so did you like did you guys do that as well I guess everyone's doing it you know, you need a little bit of a refresher sometimes. You need, a, I don't know, to sort of smooth down something. But one thing that I never can stand is eating and then drinking at the same time. Or not at the same time, but, you know, like in between and stuff like that. I don't. Usually when I eat, I just constantly eat. Um, but I also found out from um, this dietitian that I saw on YouTube earlier and she say that she had a problem she had bloating a problem when she was a kid before and that's something that I've been experiencing this past few months uh, the bloating also the belching and so she said that that was because um, that's that's what happened because if you uh, you eat too fast sorry if you eat too fast and I do I eat too fast I like big bites but not too big but yeah and I also never like take water in between as well so I just constantly eating because I don't like the taste of um, eating something with some something flavorful and then drinking water or or, or any other beverages that's completely different and then go back again it's it's just it's it's a turn off for me um so yeah her suggestion is to eat slower of course what you do is eat one spoonful and just chew you know enjoy it Now that I'm actually doing it, I don't like to chew slow as well because I do not like to enjoy food too much in my mouth. What I'm gonna do is just I'm just gonna chew the rig the regular way, but try to chew smaller and then just take my time. And I think, yeah, I think that helps as well with giving signal to your body as to not, oh, I want more and I want more. Because, you know, the more that you eat, the more it's gone. And then you'd be like, am I fully? I don't think so. So you will keep adding. So, yeah, I'm going to try to give that. you yet i actually love classic movies and i enjoy classic songs as well in the 40s and 50s are my most favorite era and william powell i have crush on him right now <laughs> ever since i watch his movie um my butler godfrey if I'm not mistaken, yeah, I love him so much. His acting was just superb. His beyond. And you could tell that he's a very nice person. And it is true. Everyone said that he's a very considerate and very kind person. First and right in the bed. 
I'll have to look that up. Oh, you need father about looking that up. so happy that I finally made progress on the next vlog the sky has been very very cloudy although you might not be able to see it and the state of my room is just a mess just ugh. when I was tested positive I was just come back from visiting my dad in the hospital with that bag so I've been putting it there didn't touch it at all ugh. I dread my duvet it's just so bulky it's a medium duvet, but why is it so bulky? And it just looks so ugly, no matter like how many times I tried to like make it look nice. I don't know, maybe... Am I doing something wrong here with the duvet? Ugh. Good morning. It is a Saturday and I'm getting ready to go to a museum. Um, I'm not sure if I already tell this, but I am finally COVID negative, so I'm all good. So I'm just gonna get ready pretty soon so I have to leave. I'm gonna have to use some of this perfume. This is my um, most favorite one right now. Gonna wear my watch. Like of the days from Cezanne, and I'm gonna have some tissue. My favorite lip balm, an AirPod. Put it there. Some hand cream. Some lipstick to touch up. Candy. 
These are my favorite candies. I really love it. Mask, of course. And then my card holder. Yes, we are set to go. as much people and it's not it's not as many people and I liked it I think I'm gonna do more of that in the future maybe try other museums around near states um, to mine so yeah um, but I just to be honest I can't wait to go back home because I have a very exciting package and that is my iPhone 14 Pro um, I finally upgraded so I've been using my iPhone 10 for I, I would say like more than four years but I'm not sure if it is or not because I think it has been more than four years but yeah um, so uh, I like it 
I like my phone and it's fine but to be honest the camera for some reason after some time it's just started to look kind of bad or cloudy sometimes and then even the volume itself uh, the speaker is not as loud as before when I first got it um, I'm pretty sure something happened to something to do with the I don't know something happened to the speaker that made it um, not as loud as before I never had that problem with my iPhone 6 so I've been meaning to like upgrade when iPhone 13 came out but I don't know my friend um, my brother keeps saying you know maybe iPhone 14 there'll be like bigger feature instead so I got the deep purple one um, everyone seemed to rave about this color I don't necessarily like the dark color but because I've always been um, getting gold or yeah gold or I think this one is silver so I want a change of scenery <laughs> a change of something um, I didn't know that would be this big of a camera. Um, the purple, I do like it. Oh, and I like the fact that it does the fingerprint. Um, it doesn't stay. So that's good. That's good. I'm just like <laughs> it protrudes so much. I'm. Okay, this is the more that you be careful, the more you're gonna drop it. I like the hmm, there's something here. I'm not sure what that is. It looks like it's just a smudge. Uh oh, <laughs> did I cause that? Can you tell the purple? I mean, it's not that deep purple. When I looked at it on YouTube, it feels like oh, it's it's black or gray, but it actually is purple. You can tell it's purple. Oh, I like this. I like the fact that it doesn't leave any fingerprints. But this camera, oh dear, it's so huge. I need to get used to this. Ugh, already it's collecting dust. Okay, I need to like put everything on first. Uh, I'm not happy that it has already collected dust there. So I'm just gonna open my case. Uh, I got the Spigen. Is that how you call it? I've always, this is like a pretty well known brand too, right? always heard it everywhere speaking okay so I got the alien 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 um, screen protector and it should come with the camera protector as well so weird okay oh goodness oh, man. 
clean my room all the time, so I don't know how there's like always dust everywhere. Is it also because of this? Oh my dear, oh lord. I'll just leave it for now. We'll see if it's gonna bother. But yeah, I think it's time to start with the script protector now. I'm scared. I know as soon as I put this on, there'll be like tons of dust. So I need to be really careful with this. Bad. I'm gonna put it in bad. Because you know, it's over here. What do you think? Oh my gosh. I think it's pretty good. I need to press it down here. The side doesn't want to like... The bubble doesn't want to go. Just gonna leave it for now. Let's turn it on. So I got the um, privacy screen, I really like it. I could tell from the camera that when I do it this way, you won't be able to see it. There you go. Ooh. So now all I need to do is reset it. It's setting up. Okay, so I got the uh, 3M claw as well. Um, I'm gonna try to hang this because when I use the Gorilla Adhesive, adhesive um, it doesn't work and you see that it, yeah, it just scraped off the paint and then I need, I need to paint that uh, somehow, but yeah, I'm gonna try to use the claw. Hopefully it works. If it does work, that would be awesome. So, I'm gonna try to... Uh, put it right here. This is like a sort of like a guide. I hope I am using it. Right. Uh oh, oh dear. Oh dear. Um that doesn't look very
Okay. I did it. Oh dear. So, it works guys, I am very happy um, that it works, um, I just can't wait to paint this and that and I'll be able to, yeah, put more shelves and maybe paintings, oh yes! This thing is magnificent. I'm so glad that I found it. I should have gotten it in the first place instead of using tapes. It doesn't make sense. This will make so much sense. And I hope it holds pretty well. It seems like it is, so yeah. Excited.